a little bit of milk Welcome back to my channel. My name is Chef Claire underscore one. Welcome back again, guys. Yes, and thank you so much for subscribing. For those who are new, kindly consider subscribing. And thank you so much for my returning viewers for always coming back to watch my videos. So, guys, come as we cook this amazing African dish. Yes. So, guys, um, today I'm going to cook this type of food. So, as you can see here, I've uh, lit my jiko. I don't think this is where I'll be cooking from. If you're watching my videos, you know this is called the jiko by now, because I've been cooking with this for a while, and uh, firewood. So today I'm cooking with charcoal. Yeah, and I've just lit this jiko. So, so I'm going to cook cow's liver. I don't know if you guys have ever tasted some of you don't eat the inside of a cow but for us Africans some of us we do so I'm going to make liver cow's liver so first of all I'm going to boil it let me let me get it so guys uh, yes I've come with my liver and this is cow's liver if you guys can if you guys have never seen cow's liver this is liver yes so it looks like this and i want to wash it i'm going to wash it uh, i had washed it already but just to rinse it off because it still has some dirt so So uh, now I'm going to boil it because it has to boil like 30 minutes for it to be cooked. So I really don't know if you guys have ever tasted liver. Kindly in the comment section comment if you've ever tasted cow's liver. So that's what you're going to cook today with our traditional meat garlic. This is how I'm going to cook. I'm going to add salt for when so that when it boils, it has some salt in. So I'm going to add salt. So I think this liver also has kidney in here because they also mix. So it's liver and kidney. Yeah, because let me show you. So this is kidney. We have kidney and we have liver here so the difference is this one looks light and this one is dark this one is dark yeah so we'll let it boil and it boils only 30 minutes and we start cooking our delicious meal so guys just stay tuned as it boils let me just close it so today it's liver day guys you should try this meal after
yes so guys it's boiling and it's almost yeah as you can see so today we're cooking liver and kidney from a cow yes the ingredients I'm going to use my spices only onions tomatoes and uh, and green pepper yes so that's what I'm going to use this is my cooking stick and you need to wash these um, vegetables very 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 well because I'm just going to cut these onions here quickly you know our liver is already done it's boiled I'm going to show you shortly and our knife here is very sharp and you know guys this food only cost uh, below two dollars yeah like uh, the beef is around one dollar is around one dollar because I bought it at Kenya 200 Kenyan shillings the liver is about 200 Kenyan shillings which is about one dollar and then uh, there is these uh, vegetables which is around 50 shillings which is less than a dollar guys guess th less than a dollar then you have milk here which is also less than a dollar uh, totaling to less than two dollars yeah so this is a food below two dollars can you imagine guys so i want us to start i want us to start cooking yeah this is amazing african village food yes so first thing we put some oil yeah because you want to fry it so guys today you're seeing me cooking liver mm? yeah so liver and kidney why am i forgetting kidney there's kidney also inside there so and it tastes so sweet so sweet so uh, so this is uh green onions direct from the farm yes and uh so next i want to cut you for it to give it, give it a taste i know after this some of you want to go and try liver and kidney from a cow i advise you to go and try because it's so sweet and healthy you know? and it's not tough like meat so this is green pepper you know I, I am enjoying doing this because I really want you to see how African foods are cooked like this one because maybe I know some of you don't know like liver and kidney can be cooked maybe some of you just eat beef yeah liver and kidney can be cooked some cook intestines we also eat intestines here yes so i want to cut my tomatoes so just this, this food african food it's below two dollars guys can you imagine mm -hmm. and it's enough for three or four or four people so i'm making african village food it's lunch so i'm making lunch for my family Guys, 
this is what boiled this is our liver <laughs> sorry about our our pan like it got burnt a little bit but this this is the boiled liver and and kidney yeah so as you can see there is kidney you can tell the difference there is kidney and liver so that's why i'm using this other pan because this other pan is uh burnt it happens it happens when you cook you can forget and uh, maybe you're, you're somewhere doing something and it does this so we wait but it's not burnt imagine it's just the pot it's not burnt just the pot as you can see so a food below two usd yes two dollars imagine Guys, I just look delicious. The way it is like this. Wow. And remember, we're using this traditional way of cooking. This is a jiko. We use charcoal with it. Yes. So, I want to put liver so that it can boil with it. Wow, wow, wow. Who will not want to eat these amazing, delicious African meal? We're going to add milk, a little bit of milk, so it will boil, wow, wow guys you should try this, then you put milk, imagine. If you don't have uh, milk, you can use coconut milk, which we don't have here in the village, so we just use milk. Yes. So, let me test this. I can't wait to have it with my ugali. Belly is also from maize flour, which I want to show you from here. Wow, 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 wow. Hmm? Hmm? Guys, you need to try this recipe. The milk makes it more sweet. So, I need to rinse it. We rinse first, then I I measure the amount of water we need to cook for our ugari. Yeah, so I'll add a little bit. So, oh, plus, guys, I added our flour, which is also just below two dollars. Our food is below two dollars. Can you imagine? You should try this meal, this delicious meal. So, um, let's wait it for it to boil. 
and then uh, we cook our ugali. You've seen me cooking this, so I'm just going to do it quickly. So this is how you cook garlic. Just, you know, do this <laughs> so this is made out of corn maize flour Yesterday I was shocked even the people from Zim Zimbabwe eat ugali. I never knew, but they call it differently. I never knew they eat ugali. I only knew it's East Africa alone they eat ugali. I never knew. Most of the countries in, in Africa don't eat this. put some little energy but even this one is just a little there's people who cook very big big ugali like uh, just like this but it's from big pots so me I'm just cooking for two people or three Just two people because we are two. So for you to know if it's done, you just do this. If it's too sticky, you continue cooking and you add some flour. Okay. So our oh, gully. After that, you do this. Then close it. We'll have to put it here. Yes. So, I want to serve. Mm. So, guys, time for serving. Serving time. So. Yeah. What? As usual, we have our okra. It's in the farm, that's why we eat it. We like cooking it. Yes, so guys, this is our food. This is our liver in the kidney. Yes, and I want to enjoy this as much. Oh, 
Oh, time for eating. Hmm. Our meal. <laughs> so, wow. Hmm. So guys, this is our delicious African meal that I cooked to garlic, kidney with liver, and okra of course. Yeah. So thank you so much for watching guys. Kindly consider subscribing, liking and commenting if you're new to the channel. Yes, and thank you so much for the returning viewers who always come and watch. Thank you so much, guys. Road to success. Bye.